Hey guys, how's it going? So as you know, with the Black Armory recently released, there are now uh, these things called forges where we can forge weapons. Who would have thought? Um, so you may or may not have uh, completed that yet, but I'm sure you know that one of the first guns you get is the, uh, the hammerhead machine gun. And rather than make a whole video about this machine gun, which is would probably be pretty boring because it's just a machine gun, um, I figured skip that you'll see a little bit of it in this video but that's not the main focus i figured while i was doing that i got this drop instead which was an old gun but with a new look this is the balligan xu7743 rolls right off the tongue but at least it looks really sleek and shiny with this new uh kind of blacked out stealth look pretty sweet so the balligan year one uh, a lot of people used it because it was, uh, or not year one, but like, you know, when things switched around and people actually could use shotguns, a lot of people used it because it hit hard, um, it had full choke and snapshot. So pretty good combination of perks that you want to see on a shotgun that you could just pull out of your collections. Uh, but this one here got a couple, couple new mods, a couple new uh, perks on it. So the one that I got here, it rolled with uh, Full Choke, Accurized Rounds, Air Assault, and Rampage, which, in my opinion, pretty solid, uh, pretty solid roll, I think. Full Choke, Accurized Rounds, not too bad. Air Assault, I don't know how good that actually is, because that's a new perk, but, you know, it doesn't sound bad. Rampage, always great. The only, uh, the only thing I would have probably preferred is a range stat on this for the, uh, the Masterwork. Because even without it, it's pretty silly. Um, it feels way more consistent than the old Balligant, um, I, which I was never really a huge fan of because it, the the RPM's a little slow for my taste. But um, you know, I played around with this a little bit. Felt pretty good. Um, I, you know, I've been pretty much using only the Chaperone re <laughs> recently, so the uh, the range on this was a little bit less than I'm used to but you know that's not really hard to compare anything to the to the chaperone because that thing just maps people but um I would say that if you can get a role like this or something with uh maybe even a different range extender for that third perk I don't know if there's anything available but definitely a fully masterworked range one with full choke accurized you're going to be looking at a pretty pretty beastly weapon here um I think uh, these these new old old new guns. I think it's pretty cool because a lot of them were kind of lame and something that I would have passed over, um, and now they're refreshed and full of new life uh, through the forge. So that's pretty cool. Um, did you guys get any of these? Let me know. Um, one other quick word about the hammerhead machine gun, since it is in this video a little bit. Um, it's pretty nasty, uh, kind of, you know, I'm glad that there's a legendary machine gun that I can use now when I have something like the chaperone out instead of using my exotic slot for the only machine gun in the game. Um, it's range is pretty insane. You can kind of just tap at people if you want, or just fully unleash into them, which is what I tend to do. The roll I got on mine was not great. I think I got like mulligan. Oh, let me pull it up real quick. I can take a take a look. I have tap the trigger and mulligan, uh, which <laughs> compared to what my friend got, which was rampage and uh, feeding frenzy, not the best roll. I'd rather have his roll. But point being, you can get some nasty rolls, and you don't have to use your exotic slot for the thunder lord. In situations where that is uh, acceptable hoping to see more machine guns get to play around with them hopefully we get some really fast ones some maybe hard hit I don't know anyway uh, that's all I really have to say about these guns for this video check out the rest of this video I guess um, you can kind of see how I use this Balagant I didn't really get too much of an opportunity to really go on a rampage pun almost not intended, but I thought about it for a little bit, so I guess kind of. Um, I, th I feel like Rampage kind of would really help this gun to, uh, you know, get that range a little bit further out without that range master work and just kind of really tear it up. The only downside that I have 
with this gun is the same as the old one where the 45 RPM it's a little bit slower than I'm used to, a little bit slower than I prefer, but if you want something that uh, hits hard and uh, can really knock some people down, it's a pretty good option. And uh, I don't know if I said this before, but I got this just as a drop from the forge. I completed the forge and it just kind of popped out. So I know you can get this gun, obviously, and a few others that way. So um, happy farming to you if you choose to do so. And uh, thanks for watching. See you guys next time.